you gonna play Pikmin 4? Since you loved 2 so much. I don't know. I'd like to play Pikmin 4. I don't know, maybe not on stream. I don't... Everyone thinks I hate Pikmin in the whole franchise. I don't. You're referring to complaints I had about the Wiimote and how I, I was annoyed at the Wiimote controls. That's what that was. I really enjoy Pikmin. I think it's a great franchise. I think it's an amazing group of video games. I just had an issue with the way that the Wiimote was, okay? He hates Pikmin. Yeah, whatever. All right, so here's the plan. Today, I'm going to finish Trip Hang 2. Just going to play it hang out. The plan this Sunday is... Well, actually, I forgot to tell you, too. And we're going to go over the sunflowers. It's not just sunflowers, by the way. We went ham this year. We got marigolds. We got wildflowers. We got sunflowers. It's a whole fucking ecosystem over here. On Sunday, I'm going to play TF2 on Sunday. I'm going to just kind of see... I'm going to gauge kind of how I like it. I'm interested in checking it out. I did mention a month or two ago, at least, that I've had the itch to play like Man vs. Machine TF2. So, why not? Why not do it on Sunday? Anyways, you guys ready? We want to hear your loudest scream. I don't think I, I can't scream loud. Anytime I scream, try to scream loud or anything, if I've ever tried to, it just kind of goes, ah! It just kind of turns into like an air horn that you press too hard. Like, or like a, you know what I mean? Like the, you turn into a toy chicken. Yeah, that's what I mean. Satellites tracked three armed individuals running in separate directions from the structure this morning at 3.30 a.m. I know how to read it. Identified as Horizon from their uniforms. By 8.20 a.m., all three had expired from exhaustion or exposure to the elements. Investigate the structure. Satellite scans initially detected four or five. All right, so we just... Go investigate the structure. I got it. You can read a clock. Pog. It gets a little weird once you go over... Okay. Once you once you go over, I think, 1,800 hours, my brain has trouble. Because, it, okay. Oh, 600 hours. That's 6 a.m. 1,200. That's noon. Okay. 1,300 is 1. 1,400 is 2. 15 is... All right. 1,500 is 3. 1,600 hours is... Or, you know what I mean? It's already, I'm already, I got it already fucked up already. Is there, I already, I already have it fucked up already. It's literally just everything minus 12. Yeah, but I don't want to do any math. I am an AM PM Andy because like I just, I don't know. It's just easier for my brain to understand. American. I'm an AM PM Andy, I am. Are you scared that the sus guy, in quotes, is going to be uttered at your funeral? No, no, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think that's happening. I think it's going to be more about like, hey, like let's, that no one's gonna talk about the sus guy. Are you gonna add Derma Dumpy Butt Naked emote? Uh, uh, I thought about it, but no. I was thinking like, what it would, how much um, what it would do for me? Why do you read the worst chat messages? Sometimes what you think is the worst chat message to me is something that I think is funny to read out loud. So, I mean, there's that. But there's also here's the problem. You also don't want to make it. You don't want to make it a thing where it's like, oh, I'm gonna read, I'm gonna read like the wacky comment out loud because. Then you start getting copycats. Oh, I, I, he's got to read my message. I'm going to say something fucking crazy. That's where you, I, I can't tell you the secret sauce because then, you know, you got to have it naturally. There's people in this building or they ran away from this building. Is there something in here? Is there like a monster? Let's find out. That scared the fuck out of me. I forgot how loud that was. <laughs> you, can, you can even see my like mouse move. This is going to be a monster. That's in here somewhere. This is, gonna be, this is gonna be like a monster going into the fridge and like drinking out of the fucking milk. I'm gonna catch him and it's gonna go. What was that? What the fuck was that? <laughs> I'm not even scared. All right, first sign of blood. What's going on here? Ugh. Okay, trial and error. We've just decrypted the data encoded within the DNA of the biomass sample. The biomass exhibits a remarkable ability to alter its own genomic sequence in response to the input data. Okay. Limited internet access. The lack of availability training is okay. Mechanism underlying the encryption scheme employed by the biomass is unusual. Okay. I don't know why. I don't know why I've read this. Right to left. Down to up. Did you notice that is what I just did? That was kind of weird. I don't know why I did it like that. All right. Well, whatever. Oh, shit. Okay. Is there going to be like a weird person in here? 
Oh god. What is that? Oh, that's the biomass. This is kind of a maze. I'm gonna, this something's gonna attack me. This thing's moving. <laughs> oh! Oh! I put a fucking hole in its head. <laughs> ah! Oh. What is that? Is that a pencil? What's this giant pencil? Why is there a giant goofy novelty pencil? It's the spear from the spear gun. Oh, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> the thing is huge. <laughs> yeah. Nice spoiler. Auto save. It's behind me. It's definitely right behind me. It's right behind me. It's right behind me. What's going on? Why is everything so quiet? Why is everything so silent? What's going on? That was scarier because it was so quiet. What do I do? Let's go! Turn it off. Got it. Do I fight that thing? Ah, the sound. All right, we're good. What the fuck is going on? Moving in to investigate. What? Is this us? Set up a perimeter around the AO. Is this us? Is this us? Is this our team? Where are they? All right, all right, all right, all right. You can't get in here. I got a lock on the door. What are you doing? Yeah! <laughs> Shit. I need a sniper rifle. I can't shoot. They're all surrounding me from every angle with laser pointers. <laughs> this guy sucks. I'm fighting an entire team of legendary warriors right now, okay? Okay, okay, all right, all right, here he comes. Why is he so fast? Why is he so fast? Why is he so fast? What the fuck? There's so many people. <laughs> what the hell? There's so many people, dude. You need to relax, it's just a game. It's not just a game. It's an intense experience. There is a sniper rifle here. All right, I have an idea. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna come back and pick this weapon up. Remind me that it's here. Because I'm definitely gonna do some sniping here like this. That was so bad, I have to restart the whole thing. I missed five shots in a row. I have to restart the entire mission. Honestly, I should, ver I should verify integrity of game cache on Steam. Just, I feel like I, I, I feel like I fucking corrupted the game being that bad. Firing. <laughs> Shit. I didn't know he was going to do that. <laughs> and it's got shit on by a bird. Airstrike means airstrike, dude. I didn't know if they were talking about right here. I guess. I guess. <laughs> so what, what do I do? Dude! <laughs> what the hell? That almost hit me. Oh! You gotta be fucking kidding me. Why would he do that? Why would you do that? 
I didn't ha I had no shots at that fucking gun. All right, here we go. Final mission of the game. Let's do it. I think I'm good. I think I have a pretty good arsenal. Holy shit, you're all so dead. Ooh, what's that? Uh, remind me that this is here. Because they, they definitely want me to do this for some reason. Smart gun? Bolts home onto enemies. Um, yeah. Are these bullets smart? Not that smart. You have to aim. <laughs> stand back! Stand back! Stand back! Stand back! Stand... Give me that, 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 give me this, give me this. There's no fucking ammo in this gun! This, <laughs> this is how I can't, I'm sorry, I can't fucking do anything. I, I can't reload the gun. No! Get off of there! Get out of my way! Dude, I got no guns left. I have no ammo left. Someone, please, you guys have to help me. You guys have to do a lot of work here. I have no bullets. Y you know what video games do a lot? And movies do this too? To the, the trope of the CEO has a message that's just being played on giant speakers throughout the entire building. There's like a, a CEO monologue that plays. Where is this a... I don't think that's that normal of an occurrence. To have like, the CEO be just like talking through giant... PA system all day at work. You do this at work. <laughs> uh oh. I I created you. Uh oh. Am I the am I a bad guy? I'm sorry, I, I didn't really hear much of what you said. I was thinking of a really cool way I was gonna kill you. Before you take off, just give me 30 minutes. I may be able to install something to help with the upload process. Oh, they're uploading the virus to the cloud. Almost got me. How is that? I want to know how it's possible that I just missed all those. How is that possible? That is impossible. If you're reading this, you are among the few who chose to remain and make a stand. I applaud your bravery. I am moved by your passion and belief in the company's values. Most of us will not live to see tomorrow, but the people of the future will thank us for the stand we make today. They may not know your names or your actions, but what we do here today will leave a mark in humanity's history. We cannot win today, but I still have one trick left up my sleeve. My last request, buy me some time. Your children will live in a better world for it. I'm, just, I'm gonna smart gun this guy. All right, should I not even give this guy a second to talk? I'm thinking about just revving up the lawnmower, opening the door, and just slow motioning. Let me get this thing ready. I don't know who's up there, but I'm gonna make a funny joke, and you'll know when it's about time for you to die. Here we go. Playing Mario Kart. <laughs> Alright, where the fuck are you? Cutscene? Ooh. Six. What have they done to you? Wait, what? You can't do this to me. I've sacrificed everything for this. He's uploading his consciousness. You have to Wait, this what? He's just lying down <laughs> naked in a chamber? That was never that was never going to work. Brain upload in progress. Wait. That guy just sprayed me in the face like a bottle well, a water bottle. Hey, uh, what's going on over there? <laughs> Where's the brain? Where's the brain upload? He's over here, out! Oh! <laughs> I just picked 
up every single fucking health pack. I'm in so much trouble. I'm in so much trouble. Smart gun out. Did you hear that? I slid by that wall and it was just. I picked up every health pack. Uh, pick it up! I'm, why would I have two sniper rifles? This is not good at all! Where's the brain? Where's the brain? Holy shit, this is hard. Oh my goodness, dude. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh my god, what is happening? Wait, I didn't even reload this gun yet! Who's talking? Who's at the dentist? Oh, oh, oh. No! No! Yeah! I need a... I need a gun right now. Do what do I do? No! Oh, I'm so glad I'm bad. I'm so glad I'm bad. I'm so glad I'm bad at this game. I'm so glad I'm bad at this. Oh, fuck! It's just so much going on. There's just too many things happening at the same time. about what ah, shit, right ah! <laughs> dude this is too much stimulation this is like overload this, this is just like i feel like i'm playing the game at times 10 speed you have to aim a uh, dude okay here's what's going on right now <laughs> all right now what the fuck do i do you idiot why would you walk over to me? Why would you walk over here? You idiot. You dumb guy. What's wrong with you? Okay. I trusted the syndicate. They betrayed me. You're walking in my footsteps, Six. Stop before it's too late. Okay. Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Shoot him! No! Oh my god. Oh my god. There was like a hundred people there. There was a hundred. Why were there so many people there? Why were there so many people? Let's do it. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. What? Is it me? Exactly, that's me. That's me. What? Wait, what? What did I do? I like teleported. Was I him? Did I like my consciousness jumped? How did I get through the wall? There was some weird stuff going on early in the game. <clears throat> you know those drones? They're like, hey, don't trust people, and you're. It's not. Everything's not what it seems. Don't fight it. And now the room filled with gas. You're our most valuable asset, 106. You served the syndicate well. It's time for you to retire now. Liquidation process initiation. I'm getting liquidated. 
equals 106. Would have been cool to have one of those. That seemed like an awesome weapon. What? Each of you were created for a special purpose. The enemy triumphs today, but our sacrifice will not be in vain. For we have planted the seed to break the cycle. I'm everybody. It's a different 106 every time. I'm everybody. You can't do this to me. I've sacrificed everything for this. Now that your purpose is fulfilled, cycle 106 is complete. No, it isn't. Not if I have anything to have. Not if I have anything to say about it. Operations are complete. The stand alive. Acknowledged. Terminate cycle 106. Uh-oh. He served us well. Oh! Wait, why would you pick a gun out? Why would you take a gun out? That's a... And point it close to my face? I was about to be burned. <laughs> oh, that guy. Hey, they're gonna write a whole entire history book about how you fucked up right there. There's gonna be textbooks written about what you did. Stand down immediately. Oh, okay. Yep, I'll stand down. What would you? Do you want me to go back and lie on the on the burn table thing? I can do that. Yeah. Where was it again? It was back here, right? Stand. Oh, yeah. Here, here we go. Okay, I'm ready. I'm really sorry. You can press. You can press the button. I won't do anything else. Here we go. Super soldiers or something. Oh. That's literally me. We're all... Oh. All right. What the? That's actually scared the shit out of me. That was right... That was behind my head. Oh my god, I hate that. What am I doing? I didn't mean to press that button. My, my fat fingered it. Where is he? Wah! I'm so sorry, guys. I just fucking... It's terrifying. Where's he going? What? 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 Turn him off. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Yep. Wow. Um I, I, Okay, I have one arm. Oh, that's the nuke. I remember I tried to blow this thing up. All right. <laughs> Don't let him get near the nuke. You think you can block that? What if I go invisible? I'm getting too greedy. Too greedy. Don't be stupid. Don't be greedy. Goodbye. Yes. Hell yeah. Those of you playing harder than hard, 
You you're a god. You are a god. I think we just blow it up, right? I played this on very hard. I have no idea how I'd go harder than that. Oh, we just nuked the bake. Oh, that's the intro. I was wondering why they kept showing that. That's... You nuking the base. I get it. That was great. That was genuinely really, really, really wonderful. There's a lot of stuff here now. What do we want to do? Enemies activate physics thrusters on death? Insane gore. All right, I don't really care about the achievements now. Let's do squeaky voices. NPCs throw a lot of grenades. NPCs respawn as jiggly boys when killed. Okay. Infinite ammo. For a second, I thought they said can't read. I was like, does that mean you can't look at intelligence? <laughs> so who has the squeaky voice? Oh. Oh my, that hurts my ears. That hurts my ears. I can't see anybody. What is, what is that? Ah! <laughs> I can't. <laughs> He's still alive! <laughs> Get out of the way, dude. Get out of the way! <laughs> it's too much. It's too much going on. Uh, I... <laughs> what just happened over here? Why would you... Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> all right. All right, all right. Let's do the sunflowers. So for those of you that are about to join me on the journey for this year's harvest, the here are the babies. The thing about sunflowers and growing anything, it's actually kind of sad what you need to do. So... When you plant sunflower seeds, oh wait, it doesn't whatever. If you have like a, you know, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that this year. You have to thin out the ones that don't really make it. If you're gonna do them in a pot, like if let's just say for instance you don't have a bunch of land to do like 50 sunflowers in a row, you plant. They have to be at least eight inches apart, 12 inches apart. But sometimes. As you see here, see the one on the left? That... That guy was ready. And he was obviously the stronger one. So... That was the one that was gonna stick around. The other ones, unfortunately, they have to go. And it's always like, no, but... But if you... Well, I'm gonna put you in a different pot. And what ends up happening is you end up having... You end up... You end up kind of transferring all the ones that weren't gonna make it to a different pot so you just end up having a bunch of pots of these ones that kind of don't make it in quotes. You kind of just try to spread them around. These ones all lived, by the way. These were dwarf sunflowers. It's the same group. As you can see, the one in the back. A little bit, a little slow to, to, to rise, but all three of these made it. But yeah, so the big ones, the ones that we have in a big pot, are here. Take a look at these ones. They end up getting a little bigger. These ones are different though. These were not these ones are not the little ones. But yeah. Again, we went with three this year. They're very, very strong, very healthy. They got to this stage pretty quickly. It was it was it was like wow, they're growing really, really, really fast. We didn't just do sunflowers though. Take a look, take a look at this one. Ooh. I don't even know. We don't even know what this flower is. We just know that it looks really nice and we want to make it look like a National Ge Geographic photo. Don't even know what it is. Is it a tulip? I don't know. This opened. This opened wide. You'll see a couple pictures of it. So I believe this is the same area. There's a little moth on this too. Yeah, see? 
There was a couple of orange ones. There was a few pink ones. There were some blue ones. They were all over the place. Oh, no. There's a bug. <laughs> so this is the one that you see on the right. Oh, sorry. On the left. That's what it opened up into. We, we don't really know what it is. We just don't. Because the wildflower packets, you just shake it out. It's just a ton of different random things. It's opium. It's not, it's not opium. Oh, uh, here's a good one. So this is, this is right before one of the sunflowers opened. Take a look at that. So as you can probably see the color this year, we had, they were kind of yellow with brown in the middle and they opened like this, but then they got to be pretty much yellow. So there's that one. Take a look at this. Aha! It is opening. So a really wild color. It's so weird because, like I said, over time, these actually get paler. All that orange in the middle goes away almost completely. Just that's how they start for the first week. Do you grow them inside? No, no, these are all outside. They, they kind of have to be. They have to be in direct sun all day. I googled sunflower and found this on the second page, bro. We stop blowing. We stop fucking with me. Come on, like I. We didn't do sunflowers this year, okay? Fine. So, what, what, what do you want me to say? Don't, don't, don't get up in here and fuck it up for me. Can I show you my favorite one? And this is a big deal, by the way. This is a big deal. A lot of times when you grow sunflowers, you get yellow, 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 yellow. This year, we got a massive orange one and it stayed orange the entire time it was here bright orange i love the depth of field too it looks so nice and who's that oh it, it's otto but yeah this thing is the size of, the middle there is as big as a fucking softball this was almost two fists together how big that middle is is gigantic my favorite. I don't want to play favorites, but that's my favorite one this year. Just, just saying. It looks stunning. Uh, here is one of the dwarf sunflowers open. Very pretty. And these only get to be. And a lot of people say, "Hey, uh, this sounds like really fun. This sounds like really cool." I, I can't do that. These are like, not even a foot tall. They're tiny. Oh, actually, wait. This might not be the dwarf one. No, this is this is just one of the regular ones. Check this shit out. So this is at full growth for the one that uh, I was just showing you. <laughs> it's like a fucking Elden Ring boss. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I believe there are eleven heads. It's just try they they were facing the other way, and it's just like ah shit. It's all right. It's okay. The photos are awesome. Yeah, this is, this is Holly taking all of these pictures. Yeah, these are these are all holly. They are very, very, very good. All right, I'm going to show you something now that's going to make you cry. You're going to cry. Hope you're ready. Mm-hmm. You ready? I don't know if you're ready. It's a hummingbird drinking out of the big orange one. Eh, not a, No big deal. Yes, we sat staring at these until one showed up. That was an entire afternoon at one point. We did get a couple of visitors. Speaking of visitors... It was really nice to see. Oh, it makes you feel kind of good. So this is a wasp. And they would just kind of pop in from time to time. If you don't like wasps, uh, then, you know, you're about to see one. But what I told you guys last week, I was like, man, when you really kind of just sit here and watch, you kind of go, they're just kind of hanging out. So this was a wasp. And this wasp found this piece of shade here. Because I told you, it's been insanely hot. It has been 100 plus 110 degrees every single day. And this little uh, this little guy found the shade and slept. He literally is sleeping here. He's lying down in the shade. He found a little spot and it's just like, it is too hot, man. Did he get up? Yeah. No, he's not dead. <laughs> Nobody tell him. Nobody tell him he's dead. No, he got up and flew away like 20 minutes later. He's not dead. <laughs> Nobody tell him. Nobody tell him. Nobody tell him. 
He got up and flew away literally 10 minutes later. It was like, oh, there he goes. Wow. He's, he's still alive, all right? He's not dead. Stop saying that. Oh, yeah? What do you, like, what do you, I, what do you think about that, huh? We got visited by all kinds of creatures. Ladybugs. Lace wings. Bumblebees. Honeybees. And these are awesome because these eat all the aphids. Something I never knew before doing plants and gardening, whatever. There is an entire group of animal that just spawns a hundred million times out of fucking nowhere and eats everything that is green. I, it doesn't even make any sense where they come from. Lace wings eat them. Ladybugs eat them. And it was actually pretty under control this year. I'm glad that the, the ecosystem kind of could do it. You should go outside and paint yourself green. Why? What do you... <laughs> Time that, time that person out for like at least five minutes. Hey, dude, can you go outside and paint yourself green? Like what? And pretend to be a flower? Ants farm them. Yeah, ants want the the delicious juice that they um, secrete, so ants will farm them. Ants will literally turn them into like these. Pr they just produce this liquid that the ants want, so the ants bring them there on purpose and just turn them into bug fucking like workers they, they essentially have like it's like a, it's like slavery it's crazy it's fucked up they literally take these aphids and like make them it's fucking crazy it's actually insane if you look into it go watch or read like anything about how what ants do to aphids it's like huh what are you talking about they no they don't do that yeah they do it's fucked up this is going to the, the marigolds the mar everything was orange this year these are marigolds. And the reason why these are here is because they help actually deter. Which I know the, the book is kind of out on this. But according to some people, marigolds actually repel a lot of insects. They, they hate them. They don't like the way they smell. So this is a little popcorn marigolds. But over here, look. Look at that. Out of focus, but there's one of the... See how small they are? That's one of the dwarf sunflowers that you saw before. And you see one, two, three? You remember in the very beginning? That's them. So we did end up pulling them out and putting them in individual pots. And they were very happy. Oh, this one's cool. This is another one kind of look, looking up at the, the big hydra. The sense of scale is hard to show, but this thing is about 10 feet tall. And no, I'm not going to stand next to it because I know a lot of people would just like shrink me and make me like four and a half feet tall. It's so weird because before these open... It's almost like there's like magic going on in here. Because the the head is closed. It just it stays closed pretty tightly. And then just one day, you can start to see color in there, and then a day or two later, the whole thing is open. It's so weird that it does that. And then a few weeks after this, it generates hundreds of seeds that you then can eat or just plant in the ground again. Plants are ridiculous. Nature is insane. I think somebody said, would you would you ever do vegetables? Vegetables kind of scare me because, well, I mean, sunflowers are technically food. Technically. But the thing about vegetables that freaks me out is I almost feel like I would, I don't know. I feel like it's, am I watering them enough? Are they going to taste okay? What about the water? Is the water, am I using like, should I use like purified water? What if it's going to be like gross, uh, water in there? What's the pH of this water? I don't know. I feel like I'd freak out about it. You should grow tomatoes. What actually does well in Vegas? I always felt like that anything that wasn't something that needs to get scorched by the sun just can't really work out here. Sunflowers work out here. Would tomatoes work? I feel like tomatoes would just get burnt. Well, money tree, uh, can you eat a money tree? I feel like that's kind of weird. I don't think I'd want to eat a money tree. Isn't it supposed to be? You're supposed to have it for like good luck. I feel like, I feel like eating it is getting is bad luck. Dragon fruit, peppers, and so draw away. Dragon fruit would do well out here. Like that sounds actually kind of fun. It was just a joke. I didn't even know money trees were real. <laughs> there you go. There's this. There are the sunflowers. There's your big fiery orange sunflower, and then the the family of eleven heads. It was very it was wild this year. You need to name them. The one on the left is Blaze, and the one on the right is Cerberus. 
You don't think we've already gone over this? Many, many times? All right, that's going to wrap it up.